Hey there, in this video I'm going to be showing you how to set up a small solar panel system at your house. The whole thing is four things. A couple of batteries, inverter, and the white box to the right of all that is the charge controller. So you start by setting up your panels outside. In this case I have six 1 amp panels set up. 15 watts a panel, so that's 90 watts coming in. I led them straight down to the main connection. It's just the six black wires all connected together and twisted tightly to that extension cord wire and the six red ones connected. Of course you're going to want to cover that up, protect it from the rain and stuff, and then just run it in the house. Feed the line into your house. That's the brown wire you see right there. So that line from the solar panels just goes into the charge controller. Okay, good. And then the output wire, which is just to the left of that in this case, clamps onto your battery. Red to red, black to black. To the charge controller. Okay, that's everything. It's all hooked up. We got the solar panels coming in. We got the cable from the output to the battery. So, solar panels to charge controller, charge controller to lead battery in your bank. And as you want to expand this to two, three, four batteries, just use some automotive cables and go from positive terminal of one to positive of the other. And with a black wire, negative terminal to negative terminal of the other one. Black to black. That's the whole thing right there. When you want to run something, just get your inverter that converts the power from DC to AC. Take the clamps, clamp them onto that same lead battery in the system. So again, red to the red post or positive side, black to the negative side, and flip it on. So remember, when you hook things up like an inverter, the charge controller, voltmeter, anything you're going to hook up on here, make sure you always pick one of the batteries to be the lead battery and hook everything to that. Whether you parallel one extra battery with it, or five, or six, or however many you want to put on there. Hey there, just one more thing I added to this. It's optional, but if you want, you can add a lighted voltmeter like this. That'll give you a constant reading on your battery bank so you know exactly what's going on with it at all times. So if you have any questions about how to hook up a system like this, uh, feel free to ask. That's everything right there that you need to hook up a solar power system.